I'm almost 100% sure you have seen this before. If you don't have one, I recommend getting one. A pencil was first made in 1500s when a large amount of graphite was found. Mass producing of pencils started in 1600s, but it was 1700s when our modern pencil was created. In 1795, a Frenchman named Nicolas Jacques Conte was working for the French army when he was requested to make a pencil that used less graphite than typical pencils. He mixed powder graphite with clay and then put them in shaped wooden sticks. If it wasn't for the clay Conte mixed into the graphite, our pencils would have been way too smudgy to do any detailed fine work. No matter what kind of pencil a person is using, he can do a lot of things with it. In old days, it was almost like a computer. People wrote novels with pencils. People made designs with pencils. People calculated with pencil on paper. One of the reasons computers are preferred over other tools is that using computers, you can easily edit and delete any kind of stuff in the data. The primary tool of writing used to be pen, which used ink, and ink couldn't be erased. But pencil markings could be erased after an eraser was invented. So basically, in old days, a pencil was a computer. Many of us still draw and sketch with pencils, and when we are young, we are still taught how to calculate with pencils on paper. Pencils are really versatile tools. It's just that there are so many of them around us that we sometimes forget how valuable and useful they are. I think it's really important to remind ourselves sometimes that things around us are actually really valuable. <laughs>